Tired of dealing with annoying flies, fruit flies, and gnats in your home? The Zevo Flying Insect Trap is your ultimate solution. Don't wait. Check out the link in the video description now to get your Zevo Flying Insect Trap on Amazon and enjoy a bug-free home today. Meet Caitlin Clark's number one fan. The legendary University of Iowa alum is dating Connor McCaffrey, a fellow basketball player and former Hawkeye himself. The couple started dating in April 2023 but didn't make their relationship public until four months later when Clark posted a photo with Connor on her Instagram. Best end to summer, she captioned a carousel of images, which featured the couple cuddled up to each other on a boat. In January 2024, Connor posted a tribute to Clark on her 22nd birthday. Wish I was there to celebrate with you, you deserve the best day, he wrote. With all that you've already accomplished, there is so much more in store for you and your special self. I admire you in every way and I love you. Connor's prediction that there would be so much more in store for Clark was right. One month later, the basketball star became the all-time leading scorer in NCAA women's basketball history when she surpassed Kelsey Plum's 3,527 points. In July 2024, Clark penned her own tribute in honor of Connor's 26th birthday. Celebrating you is easy. Thankful to have someone as selfless and as loving as you in my life. May this be the year you finally find a way to outshoot me. Love you always, she wrote. Read on to learn more about Caitlin Clark's boyfriend, Connor McCaffrey. Connor landed a job in professional sports after graduating from the University of Iowa in May 2023. He works as a team assistant for the NBA's Indiana Pacers. During his time at Iowa, Connor was a dual athlete. When he wasn't training or competing with his team, he worked toward his two bachelor's degrees in finance and political science. Connor accepted the offer with the Pacers shortly after graduating in May. His approach to the job is all hands on deck, he told Des Moines Register. I'll play dummy defense, run the scout team, help coaches on film stuff, help on video projects if they need, scouting reports if they need, he explained. Whatever you're asked to do, be ready to do it. Connor played basketball for the University of Iowa. He was a four-star recruit, arriving at Iowa in the 2017 recruiting class. The former Iowa guard was not only accomplished on the court but succeeded simultaneously in his studies, earning the team's Academic Excellence Award for five seasons. Connor was also named a five-time Academic All-Big Ten honoree, three-time NAB Honors Court, two-time Academic All-District First Team, two-time Big Ten Distinguished Scholar and NAB Honors Court honoree, according to Hawkeye Sports. Connor is the son of Fran McCaffrey, head basketball coach at the University of Iowa, who has coached at the school for 14 years. We don't know anything else, Fran told the Gazette of himself and his longtime coaching partner Tom Izzo in February 2024. We got into coaching right out of college and grinded our way up in the coaching profession. Being around young people on a daily basis keeps you young. And I don't look at my job any differently today than I did in 1983. I know that sounds weird, but it's the truth. Fran has been coaching since 1983 and is currently in his 28th season as a head coach. Prior to Iowa, he served as head coach of Lehigh University, UNC Greensboro and Siena, and played college basketball himself, too. The acclaimed coach played one season at Wake Forest before transferring to Penn. Like his father, Connor has his sights set on a coaching career. When speaking with Des Moines Register, he shared his plan to learn from the ground up with his job NBA with the Indiana Pacers. It's a way in, Connor told the outlet. It's an entry-level job. You've got to work hard and work your way up. That's obviously what I want to do. Meanwhile, his mom, Margaret McCaffrey, prefers he take a different path, perhaps one aligned with his two degrees to avoid the stresses that could come with a job as a coach. Selfishly, that's why I didn't want him to go into coaching she told Sports Illustrated in March 2023. It's excruciating to watch my husband. I don't anticipate it will be way better watching my son. There are great things about coaching and tough things about it, Margaret continued. I look forward to him discovering all of that. And will be there to support him no matter what he does. Prior to placing his focus on college basketball, Connor was a standout baseball.